Well, hey there, everybody. How y'all doing? Hope everybody's having a wonderful day or night. Welcome back to my channel. As always, I'm Deluxe. All right, let's do another freaking transform review. I love some freaking transformers. I love some new age. This is Legendary Heroes 49 EX Engineer Hammond. This is their Wheeljack in Toy Deco colors. Love the box art. Looks good up here. Got the G1 kind of thing going on. Looks good. Well, there you go on the side, Hammond. And there you go on the back. And there you go. And there you go. All right. Let's take a quick look at what he comes with. All right. Only thing he comes with is his little pistol. And it is painted silver. Nicely done. Little teeny weeny pistol. Looks good. And you have his rocket cannon or shoulder rocket cannon. And once again, all painted silver. Got some nice sculpt work in there. Yeah, it doesn't move. I thought it moves or something like that. Maybe. Nah, it doesn't. Well, it'll tab in the shoulder, and that's it. All right. Whee! All right, there is Will Jack in his Toy Deco. And man, once again, as always, beautiful paint job. Got some temple stickers right here as well. But this pearlescent white, the green, the red looks freaking awesome. Got the nice stickers right there. Got some black right there. Paint right here and right there for the front for the bumper in green. Got some red around the rims. That is nice. 539. Once again, tons of paint. All this is painted nicely. Well done. Love the black tinted out windows. Looks really good. Like that. On the back, got that. Says that. So pretty cool. And then on the back, you got the nice red for the tail lights. I like that. Little details like that I like. On the bottom, and there you go. Be like seeing that kind of thing. It rolls just fine. So very nicely done. I like it. So there you go. That is New Age Wheeljack in the Toy Deco. And man, that paint job is freaking spectacular. Love it. All right, there he is next to the Toon Deco. You got the Shatter Glass version or Slicer. And then you got the uh, Exhaust Marlboro. Now, the only difference in the weapons with the shoulder cannons, this is the Toy Deco right here with the silver. And then the toy, uh, the Toon is kind of a gray paint. That's pretty cool. Uh, the little pistols are the same. They're both silver and the same thing. But here you go. Here's the two. Like I said, here is the toy and the Toon Deco. Tell a big difference. A lot more paint on this one. Uh, well, I mean, all of this is painted, but, you know, it's got some more green and red. Uh, tinted out window is black instead of that light blue. And they got a different green, too, as well. There's a lighter green. And there's the front. You got some more paint details in there. On the side, the rims are painted red instead of white. On the back, different for the tail lights too as well. So very nice. And then you got the shattered glass as well. Very nice. I like the shattered glass colors. They look really good. The blue and the black and the red looks very nice. And you also got exhaust. So pretty cool. All right. Awesome. Awesome. There you go. That is the wheel jack that I have. And Wheelie, Magic Square Prowl. You got New Age Prime from that one. And then you got uh, Red Alert and then Dustbuster Jazz. Scale.
All right, back for transformation. Here is Will Jack and his toy deco. Man, the feet always eat me up, man. I always have to turn it around and everything. They always pop off the ball peg. So, yeah, it's a it's not a hard transformation, but, you know, it's kind of a pain in the butt sometimes. But, yeah, so here he is. Beautiful head sculpt. Love, love the silver, the gunmill silver for the face and the ears. The nice metallic blue eyes. Looks good. You got uh, paint right there. All that's painted. Looks good. Uh, look down a little bit. Look up wide a bit and then side to side and it's really tight because the, the ball peg is painted so be wary of that uh no um attitude or anything like that the little wings do move they're tight as well too so tolerances are tight on this one so better tight than loose uh, you can tab that in there all right so go up to about right there a little more than 90 degrees you do have this little drop down just because of transformation if you want to get some more poses you can go all the way around you have a more than 90 degrees for the elbow bend, a bicep swivel, and you got a little um, butterfly too as well because it's on a ball peg. All right. And you got a swivel of the hand, but this thing, this little panel right here gets in the way a little bit. So be wary of that. Uh, waist swivel, pretty good. No, not much of an eye crunch. That's about it, you know, but you can look up. So, kinda, you know, doesn't defeat the purpose. So that's very good. Uh, Van Dam all day, every day. Kick up. Kick back. Tolerances are tight. Be careful. Um, thigh swivel. Got a cut right there. You have a yeah, 90 degrees knee bend. That's pretty good. Uh, toe tilt up. A little down. Not much. And you got a little rocker too as well. And there you go. On the back, you got this stuff. Looks pretty good. Got the wings. And then with the weapons, you can tab this there's two slots right there you can put them either slot you want and i get it in the hole giggity there you go there's that and he can hold his gun if he stands up come on wheel jack jackie and it is tight too as well because it's painted so be aware of that so well, there you go. There he is all armed up, ready to go battle or, you know, fix some stuff or do whatever he does. Here's Will Jack. Great stuff. All right. So I kind of, I wish the tolerances were tight on this guy like they are on this one. Because, man, they are really loose on this. This little side panel right here holy, you know, stays in. So, yep, I wish he was tight. Giggity. But there's a difference. Uh, like I said, you got the more gunmetal silver and you got the gray paint right there. You can tell by the chest, uh, the plastic, you got the, you know, black right here and then the gray on the tune. Then you got the legs and so forth. And, you know, different weapons. Like I so said, the, the guns are the same, just the color, uh, the gray and the silver. And there is the back. You got the translucent gray wings or kind of black wings. And then you got the gray wings right there and so forth. All right. And then put them next to um, Slicer and you know different different head sculpt that's about it rest of it you know you got black plastic more gray plastic like uh the tune and he's got shoulder cannons instead of just one he's got two and they're different so there you go slicer and then exhaust once again different head sculpt and color scheme and all that good stuff there you go let's put these all together and that is the wheel jacks i have i don't know if they're going to do any more I uh, haven't seen anything yet, but there you go. There is toy, exhaust, shatter glass, and tune. And Magic Square Ultra Magnus, Mirage, New Age Megatron, Optimus Prime, B, and Mirage as well. You got uh, Core Class Wheelie. You got uh, Dr. Woo Woo Woo, Ultra Magnus, and Cosmos. You got a Seeker from Iron Factory, and then Tits McGee, Redgar. Their scale. Crapper Gonis, crappy tool paper, AAA battery, Carmex, Care Bears, Kicker, and Squeaks. More scale. Well, hey there, everybody. If you made it this far, as always, I appreciate that. Final thoughts on New Age Legend Scale Wheeljack. This is the toy version. Um, overall, he's fine. Definitely not one of my favorite molds from them. I uh, love the car mold. Looks good. Transformation. You know, it's not the hard. It's not hard, but it's just a kind of pain in the butt, especially with the feet. Uh, but, you know, it's fine. Uh, paint on this is spectacular. My gosh, the pearly... Uh, pearlescent white, the green, the red. Love the depth, you know, the um, tinted out windows. He you know, head sculpt was painted. All the weapons are painted. Really nicely done, as always, with the paint. Articulation, 
It's decent. It's pretty good. I uh, kind of wish he had a bigger ad crunch and everything, but other than that, it's fine. Uh, materials feel fine. Uh, tolerances are really tight on this one. I uh, wish it was on the tune one as well, but uh, very tight on that. Very guys. Uh, very good. I said very guys. What is that? Oh, anyways, yeah. So he's cool. Um, if I had to choose between him and the tune, I would probably get the toy version. I think it looks a little better. And um, but I like the other ones too. So I don't know what. what uh, I don't know if they're going to do maybe a G two one or something. I don't know. They haven't announced anything for Will Jack anymore. But uh, he did come with one of the pieces for uh, Autobot Spike. So that's cool. So yeah. He's all right. So, um, yeah, I guess hit me up with some likes, shares, prayers, and care bears. Hit that sub button for me if you don't mind. And hit me up with some comments. Tell me thought of the review. Did anybody get this guy? What do y'all think of it? And uh, follow me on my Discord and Instagram and on TikTok as well. Everything is in the description. I um, got this from Josie. Definitely go check those guys out. Go up to the top and say, you know, where it says your favorite uh, YouTube reviewer. Put the Lux 32. And it really helps out the channel and it shows that, you know, tells shows you that I sent you and everything. So that's pretty cool. And uh, yeah, watch my reviews. I really appreciate that too as well. So I guess I'll see you in the next Transformer review. And as always, be good to yourself. Hell freaking Transformers and hell freaking New Age. Make it not, folks. Legends is life. Yeah.